is the women's 200 metres individual medley SM6. And we'll introduce our athletes to you shortly, but uh, well, we had some very quick times posted in the heats and as we see the athletes introduced on screen, Nicole Turner, 317.09, swimming for Ireland out of lane eight. She's just 14 years of age, will swim six events in Rio this year, gaining invaluable experience in a final. Verena Schott, the silver medalist from London, the German racing in lane one, 316.63, a little off the pace there with the quicker qualifiers, but still makes the final. Sophia Elizabeth Herzog from Team USA. She's 19 years of age, also swimming six events in Rio. She was a silver medalist at the Parapan American Games in 2015 in this event. Lu Dong already has a backstroke silver medal. She'll go out hard. We know this, she was a medalist in London. Tiffany Thomas Kane from Australia, swimming in lane six, 15 years old from Sydney, very busy schedule indeed, eight events. She already has two bronze medals. Song Ling Ling, who set an Asian record in her heat, 309.93. Gold in the 100 metres backstroke, so we can also expect the Chinese swimmers both to go out strong. And here is the main challenger here. Yeltsa Vita Mareshko from Ukraine, 304.71. She's probably the biggest threat to the woman who's the favourite for this event. She already has a gold and bronze here in Rio, but here's the woman who is the all-out favourite, qualifying just over two seconds quicker than the rest of the field, Ellie Simmons, one of the most popular athletes, not just in her home country of Great Britain, but right around the world, Ellie Simmons. She's the Paralympic champion, set a Paralympic record in the heat earlier on day five, and she will be looking for gold. She's also the world record holder. She set that in December 2015 in Manchester. World record, three minutes, 0 0.01 of a second. I wonder whether she could go under three minutes in this final tonight. Simmons swimming five events in the Rio 2016 Paralympic Games. So Verena Schott, 27 year old, will swim in lane one. It's a reasonably good start from the Chinese athlete Lu Dong in lane number two and she stayed underwater quite some time and comes up with the early advantage so it's Lu Dong in the butterfly leg in lane two has the early lead almost a full body length out against Tiffany Thomas Kane who looks to be in the silver position and there's a challenge on as well from Verena Schott swimming in lane one but it'll clearly be Dong to touch in at the wall first very close for second position at this stage. We expected the Chinese athletes to go strongly, particularly in this backstroke leg, and that's exactly what's happening. But Lu Dong has the lead at the moment. It's a good swim from Tiffany Thomas Kane in lane six. And just on her right shoulder there is Mareshko, who is expected to be a very good prospect in this event. Ellie Simmons at the moment in lane four. We know she has such a kick at the end. She has an extremely strong final 50. So as long as she's staying in touch here, she should be feeling pretty comfortable at this stage. Well, that's the thing is that Mareshka will be a little bit of con uh, confidence. Lu Dong, yes, certainly she is uh, turning very nicely and is showing a real a real burst of speed in the opening half of this race but in the, the women's 200 IM SM6 
Elisabetta Mareshko is probably the swimmer to watch if you're looking for challenges to Ellie Simmons, but bear in mind she's undefeated in international competitions in this race going back to 2009, but then again, she dominated the 400 free since 2008, the Paralympic Games, and indeed it was Mareshko who beat her at the IPC World Championships in that event last year, but at the moment, the back end is turning out to prove once again just how crucial this technical breaststroke actually is because Ellie Simmons is coming into her own. Mareshko is just off her shoulder and Song Ling Ling is back into contention with Lu Dong now dropping off the pace. Ellie Simmons really made her move in the final 75 metres of that breaststroke leg. She looked so good. She went from being a couple of body lengths down to touching in and having well over a body length advantage it's very even across the silver medal position at the moment though Moreshko is staying in touch with Simmons but Simmons is now starting to really find her range kicking home for the final 25 meters remember she hasn't swum underneath three minutes over this distance her world record is just outside that she's looking fantastic Moreshko challenging for the silver medal and Song Ling Ling Next to Simmons, also challenging. There'll be a touch in it. It could be Moreshko, but Simmons touching in, and she's made it. Would you believe it? She's finally swum under three minutes, breaking her own record that stood since 2015. And Ellie Simmons, the darling of the pool, proves yet again why she's the crowd favourite. It's just beautiful to watch the final 50 that free she brings it home so strong and Moreshko had a great swim in the end much quicker than her morning heat in fact about two seconds quicker to take the silver and Song Ling Ling from China finishing a lot quicker than her earlier heat too in fact a whole six seconds quicker than what she swam in the qualifying so 3.03.19 Tiffany Thomas Kane from Australia finishes in fourth. Verena Schott from Germany. There's the Chinese athlete. And well, again, we've got the officials consulting on something. Now, might one of the medalists be in question? It's a difficult thing. It's such a technical stroke, and you're combining different abilities in different classes. So you have to wait to see what that is about. But. As it stands at the moment. That's Mareshka being helped out of the pool. Getting a kiss of congratulations from her coach. But still, we are uncertain about where the technical officials are discussing Mareshka goals in the 53 and the 100 breast. But Ellie Simmons, so dominant in this race with the 400 free still to come. Technical officials still consulting here. Tiffany Thomas Kane will be uh, doing an interview. The Australian, just 15 years old, touched fourth fastest. But if there is a disqualification in the medals, perhaps it is uh, Tiffany Thomas Kane who will end up with a medal. And I think she's waiting patiently, just in case as well. Now we await official word. But it was a smart race, swum by Ellie Simmons, didn't take it out too hard, and in the back end, so incredibly strong. Went out with a world record in her sights and came home in world record time. Yes, we saw her over that first hundred. She just did enough to stay in touch because she knows what her strength is, in particular that final 50, it's just so reliable. She hasn't seen her misfire for such a long time, and to finally break that three-minute barrier. What an achievement. It's still pretty tight, and the Chinese athletes were doing well through the backstroke, as expected. <laughs> She's just seen herself on the big screen at the Olympic Aquatic Stadium is Tiffany thomas Gade being encouraged to have a little way for the crowd. Still no official verdict on uh, what the technical officials have been discussing. There's much consultation and a great deal of interest and anxious moments for all the medalists. Yeah, awful feeling to have to wait knowing that you've swum your heart out and your hands. It's 
out of your hands at the moment and not to know well, why. Well, Mareshko, the silver medalist that's just come up, has been disqualified, which means Tiffany thomas Kane is a bronze medalist. Well, I don't know what Elisabetta Mareshko has done. On a technical, she must have been disqualified, but she touched second, but will finish with a DQ. An Asian record for Song moves her up into silver, and Tiffany thomas Kane's Oceania record sees her into the medal positions, but a world record for Ellie Simmons. The first swimmer under three minutes in this event claims the gold. That took a while of deliberation between four officials before eventually popping up, and Mareshko has been denied a fourth medal at these championships with this.